Hi everyone. So in this question, we're just being asked to, to solve uh, this equation here. And in the domain, what we've got here is uh, from 0 to 360, so that's a full positive rotation. And notice that with the, the square brackets here, we are including the 0 and the 360 in that. Okay. Might be an issue, might not be an issue. Now, I look at my equation here, 4 cosine squared uh, of theta is equal to 3. Well now, it is in the form of a quadratic, and in the, a lot of the previous questions, what I've done here is kind of sidestep that by using a variable here. In this case though, th this is a very simple equation to work with. I'm just going to divide by 4, and then to get rid of that square, I'm just going to take the square root of both sides. All I got to remember is that that spits out a positive or a negative here. Uh, the square root of 3 is 3, the square root of 2 is 2, sorry, the square root of 4 is 2. And so I get positive or negative root 3 over 2. Now, I recognize that as being a unit circle ratio. The positive and the negative are important because that tells me that I'm going to be in all four quadrants here. I know, based on reference angles, unit circles, that cosine goes to root 3 over 2 at 30 degrees. And so now, I can simply walk around the full circle here. In the first quadrant, 30 degrees is 30 degrees. In the second quadrant, I go to 180 and then go backwards 30, so that'll be 150 degrees. In the third quadrant, I go to 180 and then I go forward 30 degrees, so 210. And in the fourth quadrant, I go forward all the way to 360 and then come back 30 to get 330. Whoa, no, no not that. I'm getting a little three happy here. What's going on? 330 degrees. So those are the four angles that we're looking for in this question.